did you felt in working overall? And this doesn't have to be specific to Egypt. It can be the other places you've connected places. Um, are you restricted by um, what's happening, by the circumstances, by government officials, by rebels, by your bosses? Like, let's talk about that a little bit, about all these different things that you have to navigate. I think probably in all countries, it, you know, this time, I think it's different in each scenario, but for this period, it was, it was probably the greatest challenge was government. Um, and uh, again, I think I had it um, <coughs> fairly easy in, in Yemen, um, definitely compared to the local journalists. And, you know, I think that's something that's going to come up again uh, as we go further into this. But that is the most humbling experience when you're somewhere and you're with the, the local journalists because you realize protection that you have as a foreign journalist, not just because the money that you're able to put out for your security where you're there, but you also have the passport that gets you out of there when the spotlight's not on. And so I spent a lot of time with local journalists, and I remember um, this time uh, I was at Star, we're doing our own photography, and just had the pleasure uh, going with a, a photographer. So, you know, it's very different when you're shooting as well. You have, you have to be right in the middle of the action. So I was hanging out with the local photographers, and I remember you know, apologizing to them, so thank you, sorry, you know, the, the one running behind you, and sorry about this. And one day, you know, one of them said to me, no, oh, actually, we like you along because they don't come after us the same way. And, and they were still coming after, one day, they would still come after 